Hello everybody, Hyper Mario Sunshine here, and we are back for some more Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. So, before we get the video started, we I'm going to talk about what just happened. Uh, sorry, Trav, I'm Adam for Culture.com, uh, I have to do that. The Nintendo Direct came out, and, you know, it was good. Twilight Princess HD is coming out, Spl new Splatoon update, which I haven't gotten into yet. Uh, let's see, what else? There is a new, there is a uh, new updates for other games as well that I don't have. Xenoblade X hype, which I'll probably be, will be playing as well. Uh, uh, not only that, not only does Twilight Princess, it, not only Twilight Princess is coming out, but it's also coming out with an amiibo, Wolf Link and Midna. So I'm excited for that too. Uh, Mario and Luigi Paper Jam is finally getting a release date for the America, the Americas. And we're getting uh, Final Fantasy Fates, like, three versions of them. So that's great. I'm probably going to get that, too. Pokken is an, Pokken Tournament is now coming out. Uh, we got more information about, uh, some upcoming titles, like indies and whatnot. You know, I'm not really too happy about that, but then we have, uh, let's see, what else do we have? We have Zelda Wii, a Zelda Wii U tra uh, teaser. We also have a, uh, let's see what we have, uh, dang it. And we also have a Mega Man Legacy Collection. We have the original Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow coming February 27th to Nintendo eShops on Nintendo 3DS. So amazing, I freaking love, uh, I'm probably going to get blue version because I don't know why I think blue has the better sprites. And I'm probably going to be playing uh, with my two favorite Pokemon in that game, Blastoise and Raichu. So, Luigi leveled up, and finally, the last bit. Cloud Strife from Final Fantasy VII is in Super Smash Brothers for Wii U. I was shocked. I didn't know that so that uh, Sakurai decided to pick out uh, Cloud. From the, I'm not sure if this is like a ballot vote or not, but basically, I'm shocked. A lot of people are shocked too. Uh, I saw people hating on it, which I'll sh which I don't understand why people would think he's a clone of Ike and Shulk combined when they probably haven't even played a Final Fantasy game. Trust me, I haven't played a Final Fantasy game ever, but I'm pretty sure that that cloud like has materia i know that and he has his buster sword i'm pretty sure he's he has a lot more different things especially with his final smash people say it looks like ike's but ike came out after cloud so like i came out like in the 90s uh ike no not ike came out in the 90s cloud came out in the 90s ike came out in the 2000s And this brings me to my point that, well, Ike is not a clone. Wait, not Ike. Uh, Cloud is not a clone of Ike and Roy. He has his own little things. He's going to be his own special character. And also, I heard that Cloud was in because what I heard uh, is that Satori Water actually liked Final Fantasy a lot. When he was working with Square back in the 90s. So he would... Re so uh, I'm guessing that Sakurai did it for... S Sakurai did it for him. He asked Square if he could use it just because his friend uh, passed away. Sa Satori Wada liked Final Fantasy a lot. So yeah, that's why I heard. And I think that was very good. That was very nice of Sakurai. And very nice of Square too. So here we have uh, the Chuckle Bean spots. Yeah, we were already talking about this... this this girl tree thing is gonna tell us. Oh, go collect them. Yeah, if we have to collect like all of them, ones that are here. 
And she's pretty much a useless character. We'll never see her again. And now we can move on. Yay. I'm probably I'm very happy to get Cloud. Uh, I can't wait for the, sm the final Smash Direct. That's what I'm calling it. The final Smash Direct that's coming out this, uh, this December. So I'm hyped about it. So let's st stump on that. Okay. So yeah, I'm very hyped about it. I can't wait to go to get it. Oh, over here. I thought there was be like a hidden block. Because there is hidden blocks in this game. And they allow you to get these things called hoo-hoo blocks. So here we go. Uh, let's switch to Mario. And let's go in. Uh-oh. Poor Luigi. Yeah, Luigi always getting the short end of the stick. And the only boss you can encounter just by walking up to it like a regular enemy. We have Wiggler, stable to the Mario series. Uh, Wiggler here is is pretty much... In, I'm not, you have to attack him right here. And he's very fast. Yeah, if you don't, if you have trouble with this, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a little bit hard for you. Uh, we're gonna do, be doing the bounce bros. It's actually very useful, cause w once you could jump on Wiggler over here, he's pretty much weak. Uh, let him take that. He'll let him like try hurting me. And now we can hurt Wiggler's head. Oh, third. Yeah, not so tough after all. Yeah, and he goes up crying. Yeah, that the pro the, we were also expecting like a very hard boss, but no, it's easy as hell. Hey, that's uh for, former uh T Taco Taco for Life sixty five or whatever you want to call her. She was telling me pancakes were ready, even though I'm recording this at night. Yay, pancakes at night. I'm just gonna battle random enemies just for a few, little bit more experience. Yeah, so I'm honestly very excited about everything, especially Mario and Luigi Paper Jam, Xenoblade X, the Splatoon update, Cloud Strife coming to Smash, and that new Smash Direct, and the original Pokemon games. Those are like the main things I'm I'm very excited about from the new Smash Direct, and especially Twilight Princess as well. I'm excited about that too. Uh, Linko was also revealed in, uh, for, uh, what's it called? Hyrule Warrior Legends, which I do have Hyrule Warriors, but I'm not sure if I'm going to plan on getting uh, Hyrule Warrior Legends, to be honest with you guys. I'm, I just hope that they bring some sort of export onto the Wii U version. So anyways, we got that, and we have one more bean, uh, Chocolo fruit, uh, to get. And as you can see, there's a uh, few of these things here. Uh, there's... Okay, I thought there'll be more. So if you go up here... You uncover a lot of these, yeah. Um, they're just lying everywhere. You could... There's, this is, like, probably the most beans in the game. Like, this is probably... Except for the, the bean bean fruit, the green ones... I think that's what they're called. Not bean bean fruit. Oh my god, why am I getting so mixed up with the kingdom's name and a bean that grows in the kingdom? Awkward. And Luigi's probably gonna get hurt a lot in this battle. Uh so let's see. And Luigi stripped. Great. Oh, I wish my parents could stop calling me. And Luigi's low on health. Honestly, I can't wait to get to get older and have a capture card and whatnot, so then my parents won't have to interrupt me, even though I love them a lot. And there we go. I think we should heal up Luigi now. Syrup. And here we have a puzzle. 
Oh, okay, here we go. Another one. We're gonna need about maybe 50, no, maybe about 25 plus 50, 10. We're gonna need about 35 of those to get 100%. So this is gonna be a little tag team of Mario and Luigi working together. Okay. So yeah, so we're working together here. As you can see, now we have to head back and help out Luigi here. Okay. Okay, not spin. First, let's get this. Luigi goes there. Yeah, now we have to run all the way over there. And I think we're probably going to lose a lot of time for that. Well, this is no speedrun. Why am I saying that? And nope, it's not. It's going to be plenty of time. And we stop the time limit. And we get the final Chocola Fruit. Hooray! Easy, easy puzzles. Trust me, there's going to be even harder puzzles in the game, which I hate. It comes from the worst area in the game. Well, not necessarily the worst. I think it comes... It's more necessarily the hardest level in the game. So, let's go up to this gigantic Chocola tree. Pray for France. Yeah, the... Oh, so they were hiding here all the time. Yes. Ooh, yes. The pot... Wait. The path is open. Where we're stuck. And couldn't get past here. See, I'm here and waiting for a, for a couple of of scamos. What the heck is a scamos? Was brilliant. All right, rookie. Let's not waste any time. More, more more time. Okay. So the tree's dead forever. And pop and rookie run off ahead. Uh, there's a few secrets here. There we go. Another one. Yep, who who beans from who blocks? Basically, yeah, I think there's one more. Is there? There we go. Yeah, so there's three over here, I think. And they're very helpful because uh, these are probably the rarest ones to find. And they also have a very limited amount. But we're going to have to save the next... The save the boss for the next episode. So, next time on Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga... We will enter the Chuckle D the Chuckle D Huck Woods Chuckahola. So love my videos with a like button. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. We appreciate it. So yeah, what do you guys think of the direct? Was it good? Was it bad? Well, what's your opinion basically? Was it overall a very good direct, especially with Cloud? Were you proud with Cloud? Were you like very just excited for the announcement over announcements overall, or were you not that impressed? And you're still going to wait. So yeah. I would like to hear about your opinions. If not, it's okay. So I love my videos with a like button. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. So yeah. See you guys next time. Bye.